Okay, this is Gruel Update 3. Uh, the main work that I'm really getting done, which you guys have seen, it's on the legs and everything. I'm done for today because my hips really bother me bad. But it looks like it's mostly the same as it was. But uh, I cut the hinge down here. You can see on the other side, I cut the hinge foot and got a door made, put on. inside it does it fits pretty good I mean you got the gap down here but that's gonna be uh there'd be a piece in there for the thing and I got this done last night and I had to go this morning and get welding wire it ain't the best of weld I'll tell you that it's a lot of splatter here because I turned it up all the way because this is quarter inch and this is also quarter inch and you can see how bad the well looks. Over here, it's not. It's, it's pretty good right there. I mean, except the splatter. Right here is uh, where it was a big gap. I mean, I don't know if you can see in there. Let me show you. It's a pretty nice size gap down there. As you can see it right there. This, but it was, it was real big over here. So I had to keep on feeding it to put that in. And then I'm going to set and... Take some water pieces and put on there. But that's that hinge I got for seven bucks. It got bent up a hair because me beating on the door here. As you can see, it's right here fits real good. This piece, this don't. The door sticks out just, just a hair. Not much, but I bent it, got it back in shape as best I could. It'll work all right for what I want. So I didn't say I was a professional grill maker or barbecue pit maker it's the first one i ever made so but as you open the door there she be just got to clean the rest of this out which you can see it i started cleaning in here before and i gotta do i gotta still get these holes filled this hole right here I'm going to leave that there and might, I might put one over here like I said. And this is what it's for. That's all the rust or rust and dirt that I got out today from in here. It kept on falling. It was just falling. which you can see it right here. All I do is sweep it over. And that's what I'm going to do with the charcoal. And it'll fall right in. You could put uh, wood in here too I guess if you wanted to. If you want them to have like marshmallows or something, you could use it for that. So, there it is. Thanks for watching.